Super Nintendo Boy, and welcome back to building an adventure map, and oh boy guys, it's been quite a journey, um, and this map is still not finished, but I've come to a bit of a stopping point, I've finished off the first dungeon, and the first two towns, and I'm starting to move on to the mountain range which will extend in both directions and this way it will then curve up into a volcano around this uh, around the shore and on this side it'll go up to a point of a snowy mountain and the reason I'm telling you this is because I'm going to be just talking about the future of the map pretty much and while I'm doing that I'm going to be doing a bit of uh, terraforming here and so I might get a little out of um, focus here and there just because I'll be also working on this in the background but um, while I'm doing this I just thought I'd talk a little bit about this so I have to say you guys have been very very supportive of this series extremely farther than I could have ever imagined um, and this started actually as a really really small series and it's been going on for I think a little over a year probably a year and three or four months or something like that um, so it's been going on for quite a while and I've still kept true to just working on the map without having other people to help me majorly um, but one thing that I've really noticed is this map has a lot of bugs um, mainly because it's redstone is uh, very condensed and it's uh, made purposely just for um, you know to keep it not very laggy because it's a huge map with tons of redstone so I'm glad that you guys have been sort of uh, supportive of this idea and went along with a lot of the bugs and speaking of bugs I thought I would um, I'd mention that the last um, hold on, I'm just trying to figure out some layout here uh, I, I thought I'd mention that I've spent the last two days fixing bugs mostly in Chinmere because that was made mostly in 1.7 and even with all these bugs, you guys have been really supportive. Um, a few guys have been kind of complaining about it, but really I'm surprised all of you guys aren't like that. Because, let's be honest here, my map is really, really glitchy. So, I'm glad you guys are um, kind of supporting that, and um, you keep supporting me on that. Uh, but yeah, the boss, the final, uh, the boss of the last dungeon is finished here. Um, I'm trying to... Sorry, I'm trying to work at this while, um, I'm trying to figure out, okay. Um, but yeah, that boss is finished. I gave him an ending, which you guys can check out for yourself. And as I said, I've just been fixing tons and tons of bugs. Most of these are, um, like, problems with resetting the map and, um, finding proper ways, you know, to make things easily resettable and whatnot. Uh, also, I want you guys in this video to give me tons of ideas for the next town in the adventure map which is actually going to be a stone uh sorry not stone a snow based sort of village this whole plateau here is going to be full of snow and it's going to be draping over here and the mountain's going to go higher up and be made completely of snow towards the top um but yeah it's going to be mostly snow based so i want you guys to give um feedback on what you think it should look like I'm going to try to keep it, unlike Femvok, mostly stone-based, but it's also in the middle of, you know, winter, like, all the time, so, you know, I have to keep it somewhat stone-based. Obviously, there's not much wood. I'm probably going to have some spruce things um, here and there. Uh, what I'm doing right now, actually, is I'm trying to figure out the layout of these uh, tunnels here. To get up, you'll have to, instead of just climbing it, you'll have to go through these, and they'll be a bit maze-like. And you'll have to collect items to be able to go up onto um, the next one and whatnot, kind of like in certain Zelda games and stuff. So, um, that's what I'm doing right here. And uh, I just... Um, where was I going? Oh, yeah. So, uh, obviously I've been spending a lot of time fixing bugs. But that doesn't mean there's not tons more. And that's kind of why I'm making this. Just to sort of announce that I've made... Uh, a temporary sort of ending to the map, but also because I need you guys to help me iron out some bugs. I've decided that I want to also stop here because I want to stop to try to figure out um, most of the bugs that, well, 
I can find, and hopefully by you guys beta testing this newest version a bunch, and I'll probably notify you whenever I've come out with a newest version, and then, um, hold on, let's see, we need to go to positive Z, so we want to go to 550. Um, so I want you guys to just kind of beta test it, have fun with it, but obviously there's still a lot of bugs in here, so I want you guys to try to help me figure out, uh, what, you know, what I can kind of weed out here. Um, let's see, I'm probably going to make this sort of, um, oh, sorry about that. Um, let's see, yeah, four, and we'll set that like so. Also, I want you guys to try to give me some ideas for these little maze bits. They're kind of going to be like their own little mini dungeon to getting to the top. I'm just doing this because I kind of wanted something to do in the background while I'm talking to you guys. But yeah, pretty much there's a temporary ending. I want you guys to um, help me find bugs so I can fix them because I know there's a ton of them. But really, honestly, I can't fix them if you guys don't help me find them. And if I, if I don't fix one, make sure to keep spamming me with it. Keep saying... Hey, Super Tender Boy, you didn't fix that bug yet. Um, also, with the addition of the mountains, I'm probably going to be doing some more um, terraforming uh, montages or, you know, I forget. I, f I already forgot what it's called. Um, uh, not sp speed builds, I guess. Uh, time lapse. There we go. Sorry. Uh, yeah, I want to start doing some more terraforming time lapses along with that because obviously I got to make the mountain range just stretch a little farther in both direction. Add a lot more grass and filler terrain that you won't actually be able to go into. Um, but still, that'll be pretty cool. But yeah, give me your ideas for the snow village here and, um, you know, kind of report any bugs you can find. And um, besides that, this has just been another talky video, and um, for now, enjoy the adventure map, and as always, thank you for watching.